Now, 27 storm track weather with meteorologist Alexis Clemens. Good Saturday morning. The sun has not risen yet, but once we do see it, we are going to see a lot of sunshine through your Saturday. It is chilly as you head out the door this morning. 34 right now in Madison. We're at 37 in Janesville, 32 in Baraboo, 40 in Monroe, 29 in Lone Rock and Boscobel. Thankfully, winds are calm, not really dealing with a wind chill, but it's still cool enough, right? Temperatures are going to warm into the mid to upper 50s this afternoon. A lot of sunshine, maybe a couple of extra clouds through the afternoon and evening. If you're heading to the Wisconsin homecoming game, those temperatures through the game will likely be in the 40s. Clouds and radar here this morning. A lot of sunshine once, of course, the sun does rise. The reason why we've got high pressure in place right now, and that's keeping things sunny and seasonal for your Saturday. So it's going to be a really nice day uh, to get outside and enjoy those fall like conditions. Maybe a couple of clouds this afternoon and evening. A lot of sunshine for Sunday. Then things are going to get a little interesting as we head into uh, Monday and Tuesday. At some point on Monday, likely late in the day, we're going to watch as a warm front lifts over the region. And the reason why the timing is important there is as that warm front lifts over the region, there's going to be a slight chance for maybe some rain for parts of us, likely closer to Lake Michigan, but this would be into Monday night. A couple of showers, some sprinkles possible then. However, the main event, the best rain chance here is going to be uh, when this cold front passes over the region here. So it's going to get very warm and windy on Tuesday behind this warm front. I'm talking high temperatures near 80 degrees here, but then this cold front is going to cool us all down. We'll see those temperatures back in the 50s ahead of Halloween. Rainfall uh, time here. We're looking uh, late Wednesday into early Thursday here, but this should give us a nice little soaker. I'm thinking about a half an inch to an inch and a half of rain. It's going to be possible with this system. So that'll be a nice rain. We all know that we need it. And like I said, that time frame there is likely going to be late Wednesday into early Thursday. And I'm, I'm hopeful that because Thursday is Halloween, I'm hopeful that that rain moves out of here before trick or treating going into uh, Halloween Thursday evening. However, just know it's going to be breezy and cool. Likely going to see those temperatures in the 40s for trick or treating Thursday evening. So that's a look at your extended forecast. It gets warm on Tuesday, but then that cold front brings us some much needed rainfall there. High temperatures will be in the 50s by Thursday and Friday.